So let me give you a tour of the Lightyear One. It is the first long range solar car. So on the battery, so even at night, it can do 725 kilometers. And the solar panel, the five square meters you have on the roof, it brings in three quarters of the energy you need during the year. So that means that uh, you would only need to charge from the grid about once a month or when you do a long trip. Our mission is clean mobility for everyone everywhere. So that means we need to build the cleanest cars that get most of the energy directly from the sun and at the same time cars that everybody wants because they have long range and you don't have to charge anymore. So how do we do this? How do we make a car with such range that doesn't need to charge? So let me take you to a couple of steps. So step one is a very efficient powertrain. So the motors, the inverters, everything is super efficient and is directly in the wheels. So you don't have any gears anymore, no heat lost, ultra efficiency. And the second very important step is the solar panel itself. So it has five square meters of solar cells directly in the roof. So we try to catch almost every photon and turn it into electrical energy. So we can charge the battery and drive the car. And then the third important step is aerodynamics. So crucial is to have a small back surface. So it means the roof line needs to taper down, the sides need to taper as well. Um, and of course, the wheel pad ensures that all the air that goes around the car is nicely guided to the back of the car. So aerodynamics is not just about the back of the car, the front is also very important. We need to reduce the frontal area and the surface on the front of the vehicle. So we did a couple of things. So we have the motors and the wheels, so that means we have more airflow underneath the vehicle. So although we want to reduce the frontal area of the car, the interior space still needs to be enormous. So we need more than enough headroom, we need a lot of legroom. And we did that by looking at every centimeter to make sure we increase the interior space. And last but not least, we have rolling resistance. It has two factors. We need a lightweight car, but one secret ingredient are the tires. So the tires need to be very low rolling resistance. And a great thing about low rolling resistance tires is that it allows you to make the battery smaller. And if you make the battery smaller, you have a lighter car again. Uh, so it gets you into a positive feedback cycle. And for the tires, we collaborate with Bridgestone. We have a long history with them because we raced with their tires in the World Solar Challenge in Australia through the Outback, 3000 kilometers. And the tires that we had back then were extremely low rolling resistance. And now this is also available for customers. And we're going to have these tires on the Lightyear One as well. So efficiency will enable to build cars that have a long range on a small battery. So we can make affordable electric cars that everybody loves and it can charge directly from the sun.